Some of your relationships are about to evolve in unexpected ways. Your guardian angels are here to talk about one relationship in particular as it involves your incredible luck in future events. Someone in your life has been having a difficult time keeping you out of their mind lately. They can't help but daydream, even if they would rather ignore how they feel. The angels say such a revelation might even come across as amusing to you. You've always been the type of person to be modest, and you likely don't understand how anyone would have developed feelings for you. Comment, yes, if you believe in God and do help support us through Super Chat or watching this video completely. However, you give yourself too little credit. The truth is, there is more to you than you think, and your words hold great influence over your loved ones. You might not be aware of it, but your presence carries weight in the lives of those around you. It's not just about what you say, but how you say it, and the energy you bring into a room. Take a moment to observe your interactions with family and friends. Notice how they respond to you. Even in casual conversations, you'll find that people are drawn to your words, your insights, and your perspective. They value your opinion and seek your guidance because they trust and respect you. Your influence goes beyond mere words. It's about the sincerity and authenticity you bring to every interaction. Your genuine care and empathy resonate with others, making them feel heard, understood, and valued. People feel a connection with you because you genuinely connect with them on a deeper level. While it may seem natural to you, this ability to inspire trust and admiration in others is a rare quality. Not everyone possesses the same level of impact in their relationships. Therefore, it's essential to recognize and embrace the influence you have as it plays a significant role in shaping the dynamics of your connections. Understanding the power of your influence helps you comprehend why someone might develop feelings for you. It's not just about superficial qualities or external factors. It's about the genuine connection and emotional resonance you create with others. Once you recognize this, you'll see why you are deserving of love and admiration from those around you. Your guardian angels are sharing this message because they recognize the profound significance of the person in question to your life's journey. They want you to understand that this individual is not just a passing acquaintance but someone intricately linked to your destiny in numerous ways. As you navigate the complex web of life's possibilities, you'll encounter various paths, each presenting its unique set of challenges and opportunities. These paths represent the myriad choices and decisions you'll face along the way shaping the course of your future. Amidst this intricate tapestry of possibilities, your guardian angels want to emphasize that the presence of this person is a recurring theme, woven into the fabric of many of these potential futures. Whether it's through profound connections, shared experiences, or pivotal moments, they are destined to play a significant role in your life's unfolding narrative. While the future remains uncertain and subject to change based on your choices and actions, the consistent presence of this individual across multiple paths is a powerful indication of their importance in your life's journey. They are not just a random occurrence, but a fundamental aspect of your destiny, guiding you towards growth, fulfillment, and self-discovery. By recognizing the deep connection you share with this person and embracing their presence in your life, you open yourself up to the rich tapestry of experiences and opportunities that lie ahead. Together, you are destined to embark on a transformative journey filled with love, growth, and profound connection, shaping each other's destinies in ways both known and yet to be discovered. Before continuing this message, it's important to be aware of powerful synchronicity signs connected to your journey so far. The universe utilizes these synchronicity signs to share messages, even if you might chalk these events off as mere coincidences. The synchronicity signs can be found at the end of this message, so it's a good idea to watch the whole video. Now, to the rest of the message, someone in your life, someone relatively close, is experiencing a crisis due to how they feel about you. As a matter of fact, they're outright terrified of how they feel because of the implications. They don't know how to deal with what they're feeling, but they will come around eventually. I repeat, they're terrified of their feelings for you because they're not used to having romantic feelings for anyone. Fortunately, with a little bit of patience, you can help them come to terms with their feelings. What are your thoughts on entering a romantic relationship? Does the thought of it excite you? Have you ever had a romantic relationship before? These are all important questions to answer as the universe is set to change your life in a few surprising ways. 
Even if you feel as though you aren't ready, there's no denying that the excitement that stems from a romantic relationship is ubiquitous. Just about every person is interested in romance at one point or another, though of course, there are exceptions. In your case, this person is indeed excited to be in a relationship, even if they are terrified of their own feelings. They're not used to these kinds of feelings, which is why the butterflies in their stomach are enough to make them nervous. If ever you're wondering who this person might be, you can probably catch them by how strangely they act around you. If you're unable to spot this individual, there's no need to worry. After all, they will eventually come to terms with these feelings. When they do, they are likely to make the first move. If you're feeling unsure about the whole thing and you aren't comfortable with the idea of a romantic relationship, don't worry. Even if they make the first move, you are free to reject their advances. The cosmos isn't going to place anything on your plate that you cannot handle. No matter what happens, your relationship will deepen, but it doesn't always have to be connected to romance. Even if this person has feelings for you, they will not do anything to break your trust. While they will want to try to start something with you, they would still prefer to have you as a friend. If you decide to say no, remember that the universe is always trying to put you on the best possible path. Your decisions matter, and depending on these choices, the cosmos will shift accordingly. You are always in control. On the other hand, if you are interested in the prospect of a relationship, then it's important to talk about how this bond will affect you in the future. There's no denying this person has your best interests at heart, and so you are undoubtedly in good hands. While they might have little experience in romantic endeavors, it's a learning experience for you both. This person is not just someone who can offer a romantic partnership. They're known to be a go-getter in life, which means they are likely to climb the career ladder quicker than most. The two of you will act as opposites in that your strengths cover their weaknesses and vice versa. It will be an incredible experience, but it is not without its fair share of challenges. This person is strong-willed, and at one point or another, if you're willing to compromise, it will lead to happiness and prosperity down the road. Of course, this will only happen if you're willing to give it a try. If you're unsure and would prefer to wait things out, this person is fine with a platonic relationship. However, know that this opportunity will not always be there. You cannot expect someone who has strong feelings for you to wait at your beck and call. Your guardian angels urge you to be open-minded and to be patient with this person. Since they are still getting used to the idea of having feelings for you, they may act out of character. This could lead to some misunderstandings, but since you are already well aware of their feelings thanks to this message, it will be easier to handle. The synchronicity signs connected to your journey start with white sand. White sand is found on certain isolated beaches. White sand symbolizes infinite potential, as each grain of sand is impossible to count. The white color symbolizes purity, which has to do with the person's lack of experience in romantic relationships. White sand represents the potential of your relationship with this individual, and it is also a symbol of luck and good fortune. Another synchronicity sign involves the number pattern 555. This is often considered an angelic pattern, and such a pattern precedes your luckiest moments in life. Pay close attention to these synchronicity signs as they will help you open yourself up to the many blessings of the universe. Imagine embarking on a journey through an unknown landscape where each step forward is an act of faith and each breath a whisper of hope. This journey is not marked by the visible challenges of towering peaks or vast oceans, but by the internal battles that we face. It is marked by the moments of doubt, fear, and uncertainty that cloud our path. Yet, it is in these very moments that a profound truth emerges, a beacon of hope in the darkness. God is for us. He is the compass that guides us, the light that illuminates our path, and the strength that carries us forward. Today, we will delve into understanding how to find strength in the Lord and be assured that He will never fail us. I am also going to pray a powerful prayer with you in the mighty name of Jesus. So watch until the end and open your hearts to receive the blessings of this prayer. In Isaiah 41 verse 10, we find a promise that anchors us. Fear not, for I am with you. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you, yes, I will help you, I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. This verse is not just a comforting thought, it is the very essence of God's promise to us, 
an assurance that no matter the journey, we are never alone. Together, we will discover the means to navigate life's uncertainties, fortified by the knowledge that God's presence is ever with us. Now, as we journey through life, we often encounter terrains that test our faith and resolve. These moments filled with uncertainty can make us feel as though we are journeying through a thick fog, each step uncertain, each decision filled with the potential for misstep or the risk of error. Yet, it is precisely in these moments of vulnerability that God's promise to be with us, to guide and strengthen us, becomes most tangible. Life's journey is unpredictable. We face challenges that seem insurmountable, problems that appear unsolvable, and questions that seem unanswerable. It is in these times when the fog of uncertainty surrounds us that the weight of our own weakness becomes most apparent. However, it is also in these times that the strength of God's presence shines brightest. The story of David and Goliath is told in 1 Samuel 17 verse 45 serves as a powerful reminder of this truth. Facing a giant, David declared, You come to me with a sword, with a spear, and with a javelin. But I come to you in the name of the Lord of hosts, the God of the armies of Israel, whom you have defied. David's confidence did not stem from his own capabilities, but from his faith in God's power. Like David, we are called to face the giants in our lives not with fear, but with the assurance that God is with us, providing the strength we need to overcome. This journey through life, with its highs and lows, is not a journey taken alone, but a shared journey with God as our constant companion. His promise to be with us is not just a reassurance of presence, but an assurance of active support. In moments of weakness, He provides strength. In times of doubt, He offers faith. And in periods of turmoil, He grants peace. Philippians 4 verse 13 captures this beautifully. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. This verse is a testament to the transformative power of God's strength in our lives, a reminder that regardless of the challenges we face, we possess the capability to overcome them, not through our own might, but through the strength granted to us by Christ. As we navigate the uncertainties of life, let us remember that we do not walk alone. The fog of doubt and fear may at times cloud our path, but the light of God's presence is a constant guide. His word the compass that directs us, and His strength the foundation upon which we can build our resilience. In embracing this journey, let us draw near to God, seeking His guidance and strength in every step. Let us trust in His promise to be with us, to strengthen us, and to uphold us. And as we do so, let us find comfort in the knowledge that no matter the challenges we encounter, we are journeying with the Almighty God who never fails us. Let us now explore the practical implications of God's favor and guidance and how His presence empowers us to face life's adversities with strength and confidence. As we journey through life, it often feels as though we are navigating a vast, uncharted wilderness. The terrain is rough, the paths are unmarked, and the destination seems distant. It's in these moments of uncertainty and struggle that the presence of a guide can make all the difference, a guide who not only knows the way, but also walks with us, offering support, encouragement, and direction. This guide is God, and His promise to be with us is a testament to His unfailing support. Consider the words of Romans 8 verse 31, which boldly declares, What then shall we say to these things? If God is for us, who can be against us? This verse is not just a rhetorical question, it's a declaration of divine support. It reassures us that with God on our side, the challenges and adversaries that we face lose their power over us. The realization that the Creator of the heavens and the earth is for us should fill our hearts with courage and our steps with confidence. This simple truth changes everything. It means that no matter what we face, we are not overwhelmed because our God is bigger than our struggles. Knowing this, we can face anything, understanding that with God, we are always in a position of strength. This reassurance helps us stand firm no matter what comes our way, confident that we are never alone or without help. Now, this assurance of God being for us is not meant to suggest that our journey will be without challenge. Rather, it is a reminder that when we encounter obstacles, we do not face them alone. The battles we fight are fought with God's strength, and the victories we claim are won through His might. 
Just as a seasoned guide leads a traveler through treacherous terrain, God guides us, offering his wisdom and strength to navigate the complexities of life. The practical application of this truth is seen in our daily lives. When we face decisions that leave us perplexed, God's wisdom is available to guide us. When we encounter situations that threaten to overwhelm us, His strength is sufficient to sustain us. And when we feel isolated or abandoned, His presence is a constant companion, offering comfort and reassurance. But how do we tap into this divine support? The key lies in our relationship with God. Just as communication is vital between a traveler and their guide, so too is our communication with God. Prayer becomes the medium through which we express our fears, our hopes, and our needs. And it is through the study of His Word and the leading of the Holy Spirit that we gain insight into His character, His promises, and His will for our lives. Furthermore, the journey of faith is one that requires trust. Trust in God's timing, trust in His promises, and trust in His character. It is a trust that is built over time through experiences that testify to God's faithfulness and goodness. Each challenge overcome and each need met serves as a milestone in our journey of faith, reinforcing our trust in God and His provision. This journey, though personal, is also shared. As believers, we are part of a community of faith, a family of fellow travelers who share the road with us. This community offers support, encouragement, and accountability reminding us that we are not alone in our journey. It is within this community that we find opportunities to share our stories, to celebrate our victories, and to encourage one another in times of struggle. As we reflect on the assurance that God is for us, let us also consider the response that it calls for from each of us, a response of faith, of trust, and of obedience. The faith that God is who He says He is, the trust that He will do what He has promised, and the obedience to His guidance and commandments. It is through this response that we experience the fullness of God's support and guidance in our lives. Therefore, let us carry with us the assurance that God is indeed for us. Let this truth anchor us in times of uncertainty, strengthen us in times of weakness, and guide us in times of decision. For with God on our side, we have nothing to fear. We really don't. Remember, the devil is a liar. Let us move forward in faith, confident in the knowledge that no matter what we face, we do not face it alone. God is with us, He is for us, and through Him, we are more than conquerors. We will now turn our attention to the transformative power of embracing God's strength in our lives. Throughout the course of our daily lives, we encounter various forms of adversity, moments that test our faith, challenge our resolve, and sometimes threaten to overwhelm us. It's in these moments that the true depth of our reliance on God is revealed. The realization that our strength alone is insufficient is not a cause for despair, but an invitation to lean fully into the strength that God provides. This reliance on divine strength is not a sign of weakness, but a testament to our understanding of where our true power lies. The Apostle Paul's words in 2 Corinthians 12 verses 9 to 10 serve as a profound reminder of this truth. He said to me, My grace is sufficient for you, for my strength is made perfect in weakness. Therefore, most gladly I will rather boast in my infirmities, that the power of Christ may rest upon me. Therefore I take pleasure in infirmities, in reproaches, in needs, in persecutions, in distresses, for Christ's sake. For when I am weak, then I am strong. This seemingly contradictory statement highlights the core of Christian strength. We do not take pride in our own power, but in God's. Our weaknesses and obstacles turn into opportunities for God's strength and grace to shine through in our lives. Embracing God's strength requires a shift in perspective. It means viewing our challenges through the lens of faith, recognizing that with God, no obstacle is insurmountable. This shift doesn't negate the reality of our struggles, but places them in the context of God's greater power and purpose. Again, it's an acknowledgement that our journey through life is not undertaken alone, but in collaboration with the divine, where our efforts are enhanced and completed by God's power. This divine partnership empowers us to approach life's battles with a different mindset. Instead of being overwhelmed by the magnitude of our challenges, we are encouraged by the knowledge that God is with us, 
fighting for us and through him, we have victory. And remember, this doesn't mean we won't face difficulties or that our faith won't be tested. What it does mean is that in the midst of our battles, we have a source of strength that is inexhaustible, a well of courage that never runs dry, and a promise of victory that is certain. Living in the strength that God provides also has a profound impact on how we relate to others. It compels us to move beyond our limitations and to act with compassion, courage, and conviction. As we experience God's strength in our lives, we are motivated to be agents of His love and grace in the world around us. Our battles, once seen as personal struggles, become opportunities to testify to God's power and to offer hope to others facing similar challenges. My friends, let us also consider that our God is unchanging and unfailing in nature. His steadfast love and faithfulness are our constant companions through every season. To truly grasp that He is for us, we must also understand that He will never fail us. And in so doing, we must understand His character. God is not like humans who might make promises only to break them when circumstances change. God's promises are as unshakable as His very nature. When He commits to being by our side, He means it for eternity. This assurance enables us to be confident that He is for us and face the uncertainties and challenges of life with a calm heart and a steady spirit, knowing that regardless of what we encounter, God's support remains unwavering. Living with the knowledge that God will never fail us transforms the way we approach every aspect of our existence. It allows us to take bold steps of faith, to dream big, and to pursue our God-given destinies without fear of abandonment. When we stumble or fall, as we inevitably will, this promise offers us the strength to rise again, dust ourselves off, and continue the journey. It's a reminder that our failures do not define us in the eyes of God. Rather, His unfailing presence is a testament to our inherent worth and potential in Him. Therefore, let us carry forward the assurance that no matter the trials we face or the mountains we must climb, God's presence and support are guaranteed. God is for us. He is with us every step of the way. His promise is as reliable as the dawn. In every moment of doubt, every season of struggle, and every celebration of victory, may we remember this. Our God will never fail us. My friends, let's carry with us the empowering truth that resonates at the heart of our message. God is for you. So be strong in the Lord. He will never fail you. In every step of your journey through the highs and the lows, remember that you are never walking alone. The Lord stands beside you as a steadfast guide, offering His strength, His love, and His unwavering support. Let this knowledge fill you with courage and hope. When you face the mountains of life, look to Him, draw from His infinite strength, and move forward with confidence. For in the Lord, you have an unshakable support, and with Him, you will navigate the challenges of life not just with endurance, but with victory. Be strong in the Lord, my dear friends, for He will never fail you. Now, to all those within the sound of my voice, let us go to the Lord in prayer. I want you to pray this prayer with me so that you can have all the blessings of this prayer. Let us pray to our gracious and loving God. Heavenly Father, Almighty God, I come before you with a heart full of thanksgiving and praise. I acknowledge your greatness your majesty, and your sovereignty over all creation. You are the rock of ages, the King of kings, and Lord of lords, worthy of all glory, honor, and praise. Your power is unmatched, your wisdom and love are boundless. I worship you, Lord, for who you are, my fortress, my deliverer, and my strength. Lord, I give you thanks for the gift of life and for the countless blessings you have poured into my life and the lives of my loved ones. I am grateful for your mercies that are new every morning and for your grace that sustains me. Thank you for your unwavering presence and for walking beside me through every trial and triumph. Lord, I ask for your forgiveness for my sins, for the times I have fallen short of your glory. I also choose to forgive those who have wronged me, releasing any bitterness or resentment in my heart. Cleanse me, Lord, and renew a right spirit within me. Father, I stand on your promises, drawing strength from your word. I declare in the mighty name of Jesus that no weapon formed against me shall prosper. I rebuke the spirit of fear, doubt, and discouragement, binding them in the name of Jesus, and I claim faith, 
hope, and love in my life. Lord, empower me to be strong in you and in the power of your might. Fill me with the wisdom, courage, and strength to face life's battles, knowing that with you, victory is assured. I decree healing over my body, mind, and spirit in the name of Jesus. I pray for your healing touch upon my loved ones. Mighty God, I stand against every attack of the enemy, praying against sickness, depression, financial lack, and strife. I claim protection over myself and my loved ones, asking you to shield us from all harm and to guide our steps. Bless us, Father, with your favor and peace, and may your healing hand touch every area of our lives that needs restoration. Lord, as I say this prayer together with everyone listening, I am grateful for every heart that is opening before you right now. We come in agreement, standing united in faith as we pray for each other. Strengthen us, Lord, to overcome every challenge with grace and to walk in your ways. Fill us with your Holy Spirit, guiding us into all truth and empowering us to live lives that honor you. Bless us, Lord, with your presence. May we experience your profound peace, joy, and love in abundance. Protect us from the snares of the enemy and let your hand be upon us for good. We declare your lordship over our lives, claiming victory over every battle, healing for every wound and sickness, and provision for every need. Let your will be done in our lives and in the lives of my loved ones, for yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Thank you, Lord, for hearing and answering my prayer in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Curious to discover more life-changing insights like these? Then dive right into our next video. It's a journey you won't want to miss. Click on the video and let's keep the universal's wisdom flowing.